some uh, gateway boxes, and we have uh, HDMI sticks that we're we have uh, we're running on. Great. And uh, so uh, this is uh, one of our user interfaces, and we uh, have underlying kind of building blocks for for guides. Some operators will will use to deploy our, our guide. Others will. Um, uh, use our building block, which is our windmill, and uh, we'll work with them to customize a guide. Yeah, yeah, it's own complete, different yeah. look and feel. This is uh, on our HDMI stick. This is what we're showing is our ability to run both Android and RDK and HTML5 all in the, the same mm -hmm. uh, environment and intelligently switch between them. So this is Time Warner's uh, Android application. Mm -hmm. So, uh, Android application. So it, it's a uh, you could navigate Time Warner's guide with an Android device. Then? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So they built this to, to run on an Android device. And so. what type of remote is that that you have there? This one's so. just. Uh, we did this for development. This is just a, an RF. Okay. So um, since I'm going off these sticks, these sticks, they're, when they go into production, the operator will uh, pick if they want them to be RF or IR or okay. Bluetooth or what they. Yeah, so we just we just yeah. use this. So um, we were just looking at a uh, an Android application, and then this is our, our launcher that we have that goes in between. So I'll uh, I'll go over and, and launch a uh, this Cox Trio, which is a HTML HTML5 guide. And now the whole whole setup box is rebooting and loading a, a completely new user experience and, and guide. Wow. So uh, here, you know, this is this is uh, kind of what Cox has done. Mm -hmm. guide. You kind of see there. So is is Alticast working with Cox like on the on the contour guide or is this a new um, guide? Well, this is, you know, they're um, they just allowed us to, to port their guide. We're sure. working with them on a couple other other things, but uh, not specifically on this guide. Okay. So I'll show you kind of more demo in another area. Mm -hmm. But this is a a kind of an upgraded version of this that we're working on to show more of a customized mm -hmm. user experience. Okay. And then uh, other things that we're showing that we do on top of RDK is uh, an app store. So we have a complete app store that operators can do. Mm -hmm. And this is the management side. We have both a, a developer uh, area where uh, a developer can kind of load in their applications. And then uh, we have a, an operator management area where they can manage, verify that they want this application to, to go. Okay. And then under the app store, which I'll, I'll switch over to here. And we have this deployed in, uh, in Korea. Mm -hmm. So within the App Store, then they can, yeah. can um, pick applications to run from various providers. Okay. All uh, kind of Java based applications. You kind of you find out the information. Great. example of a kind of a kid's storybook mm -hmm. that uh, we don't have the audio but it has audio and this one in the background and, and kind of reads a, you know, a story but there can be all kinds of different different types there we'll see the numbers okay and, uh, so that's kind of the